I'm about to review this stacked Fortnite locker right here. As you can see, they're wearing the Ray skin from Star Wars, which hasn't returned and is pretty rare. They do have the pickaxe, bat bling, and also switch step, which hasn't been out in almost 700 days now, so already many rare items. But let's start it off with the skins. If you do enjoy, make sure you drop a like and subscribe if you're new. So from the top, they have Dark Bomber, the Dark Red Knight from the pack and also Dark Heart. A few DC skins right here, the new Polar Peely, and also the new Ice Pack with Midas, the Renegade Raider, and Crystal. In my opinion, Midas is the best one. They have Kami, Jill, and also Astro Jack, which should never return, as well as Travis Scott right here from Chapter 2, Season 2. These skins haven't been out in almost 700 days and it's just crazy to think that they will never come back. They do also have the OG Black Widow outfit from Season 8. Now this skin hasn't been out in over 900 days and it also might not return, which means it could become a 1000 day skin, so who's got the OG Black Widow? They have Dark Phoenix which is kind of underrated, MJ from No Way Home, the Slurp Legends pack which I never see anybody with this. And then of course Ray, which is equipped right now. Onto legendary skins, they have Aim, Crackshot, Fusion, Galaxy Grappler, Galaxy Scout, and this is their mayor right here. They do also have Glow, which is the first exclusive of the account. I mean, Glow was pretty easy to get, quite a lot of people have it. John Wick, which in my opinion, this is actually better than the Reaper. Midas, which is fully gold, so maybe they have some of the others fully gold. And this bat bling matches really nicely. Power Cord from Season 3, Red Knight, the Ice King, and also the Ice Queen. Ultima Knight, Velocity, and Aerobic Assassin. Now, when this skin returned, I thought they would have brought back Disc Spinner, as in the Disc Spinner trailer, they did use the male version of this skin. And maybe this locker has the emote. We're going to find out real soon. Agent Peely, but I don't think it's gold. Blitz, now this actually hasn't been out in like 600 or 700 days. It doesn't feel like it, but they're actually getting rare now. Brutus, which yes, this one is fully gold. Bunker Jonesy, Bunny Brawler, Bunny Wolf. I never see anyone using this skin, but it's not too bad. Katrina from the Halloween pack, Cube Assassin, which was a crew pack skin, Darby Dynamo, Ellen Ripley. I mean, they do have some really good skins, Ghoul Trooper, Kuno, Lace, and Joel Terror, which who actually bought one of the Halloween superhero skins because I never see anyone with these as well. Minty Bomber from the new Minty Legends pack, two Mogul Masters. Starflare, which I don't think we've seen this skin return recently. And again, I never see it. So let me know if you have Starflare. I don't think it's a bad skin at all. They got Sugar Plum, TNT Nerd. This one's fully gold as well. The Bubble Bomber from Season X. There, which used to be rare, but it's not anymore because you guys know it just returned. Fastball, Flatfoot, and Flutter, which is one of my favorite skins, to be honest. I mean, my favorite color is blue, and this has a lot of blue on it. So yeah, I think it's really clean. Fortune. Now, this is actually quite a rare skin i don't think it's been out in around 500 days now and again it's just one of those skins i never ever see i kind of forgot about it to be honest frankenstein's bride from halloween another skin which i hardly saw anyone buy guff the one and only Kalia, another pretty rare skin which is underrated this hasn't been out in around 500 days as well from chapter 2 season 3 i wonder when this one's gonna come back and limelight which is a really rare skin from season x in fact, this skin hasn't been out in around 700 days now and was only in the shop a few times. So yeah, I never see this skin. It does have two styles. The juice is the second style. I mean, yeah, do you guys even know about the skin? Like literally nobody wears it. Rally Rider, this kind of looks like shade if you ask me. Ruby and also Rue. Okay, so this skin hasn't been out in over 610 days. However, it only came to the shop once and never returned. The pickaxe for it did return not too long ago, so I'm not sure why the skin hasn't came back. I mean, I think I know why, but I'm starting to wonder, will we ever see this skin return? I think it should come back because it's really clean, and for those people who didn't get the chance to buy it, they should be able to get it. Part of the Lil Red set, but yeah, I think it's a good skin. They have School Ranger, Scully, and also the Sparkle Skull, which hasn't returned since the Ariana Grande event. Again, will this ever return? I don't even know. They do also have the Terra skin, which was last seen over a year ago now. 
So, kind of getting rare. I don't see too many people with this. Yo, this combo looks fire, by the way. But yeah, not a bad skin. Again, I'm not sure why it hasn't returned. They have Clash as well from Chapter 2 Season 1. Another pretty rare skin. This didn't return last Valentine's, but it might return in February. So, if you're trying to get it, look out for it in the shop. And I think that is going to be it for skins. Oh wait, they do have the World Warrior as well, which hasn't been out in around 900 days now. So yeah, you guys already know, it's getting rare. But it is time for emo, so let's go ahead and see what they got. Starting it from the top, they do have Headbanger from the Travis Scott set. Again, this emo should never return and it is pretty rare now. Also have Rage from the Travis Scott challenges. I mean, this emo is alright. Crazy Boy, currently the rarest icon series emo in the game. It's not been out for over 400 days now. Also super clean, I love the music to this one. Frolic, which is pretty new. Again though, a good emo for sure. Who picked up Frolic by the way? Let me know. And they do also have Shake and Slash and Shake and Split, the new icon series emotes. On to Marvel, they have Mighty Ants. I mean, all of the Marvel emotes just returned other than Widow's Pirouette. This hasn't been out in over 900 days. They have Dark Side and Resistance Thumbs Up from Star Wars. But this one and also Traitor still haven't came back and are pretty rare. So we're on to Epic emotes. Let's see if they have anything rare over here. I mean, they have Hula, which again, hasn't been out in around 200 days, but not a lot of people know that, and it is starting to get rare, low-key. Phone it in, Llama Kadabra. Now, this one didn't come back in December, so yeah, I don't know when it's gonna come back, but it's not been out in around 400 days almost. Oh, okay, they have Vivacious. I think this is the rarest epic emote besides Fresh. It's not been out in like 600 or 700 days almost. Very clean. Accolades, which since that locker bundle, this emote just hasn't came back. Around the Clock, which did just return at Christmas. Such a good emote though, nevertheless. Balletic, this one's starting to get rare now. Not been out in over 250 days. Bobbin as well. This one's like a 230 day emote. There's a lot of emotes that are now starting to get rare. People don't even know about. However, Bombastic is currently a rare emote while I'm recording this video. But there's been many hints and teasers that this emote might return sometime soon. And yeah, it's one of my favorites in the game. It's so clean. Busy, which we all saw Crisabelle doing this emote in the Winter Lodge. Capo era. Yo, this account is actually stacked by the way. Like how many rare emotes do they have? And also cartwheeling is next to Capo era. Another really rare traversal emote. But then if you look to the left, they do also have chicken. Another really rare emote. Yo, this account is going to get a high rating. That's for sure. Crazy feet, which came back before Christmas. Still a good emote though. Deep end and also disc spinner next to deep end from chapter two, season one. I literally spoke about this emote a minute ago. And yeah, they have it super clean. Don't know when it's going to return though. Maybe in the summer, maybe soon. Who knows? Dragon Stance from the Season 8 Challenges, Dream Feet, Drum Major, such a clean emo. Yo, they have Fanciful. This is currently the rarest traversal emo in the game. It's not been out in almost 900 days. I mean, yeah, this is a really rare emo, but it might return soon. Who knows? Fancy Feet, Flipping Sexy, and Flapper, which just came back. Yo, if these two emotes came back, does that mean Flux is gonna be returning soon? I don't know, guys, but it is a rare emote as I'm recording this video, and it's not too bad. Remix from Chapter 2, Season 1. I don't think this has been out in a while now as well. Fright Funk, Glitter, and also Glyphic, one of the most popular emotes in the game as we speak. I know a lot of people want this one to return. And to be honest, I don't blame you. The music's pretty catchy. The dance is pretty clean. Yeah, it's not too bad. Hoot Nanny from Season 3. This one's pretty OG. I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of it. However, I do like the movie where this emote is from. Yo, Jitterbug. Guys, can we take a minute? This emote finally returned after 820 days. This was a very popular emote. A lot of people wanted it and I'm glad everyone got the chance to buy it now. Nevertheless though, it is pretty catchy and it's still a good dance. Lavish, which we all know, this is the rarest item shop emote in the game. This account is just stacked. It has like almost every rare dance. I think Jitterbug and Lavish were the two most popular emotes people wanted to return. So I guess it's just Lavish now. Let's see when this one's going to return. They have Pick It Up. This one's super clean. And again, we've not seen it in a while. But it was used in a trailer, which I don't know. Could it return? Maybe. 
Praise the Tomato, and also Raw from the Dino God set. A lot of OG players will remember this one, and who knows when it's gonna return. Has been like almost 900 days? Slap Happy, I actually do like this emo, and I do use it quite a lot. Super clean in my opinion. Sugar Rush, Switch Step, Step It Up. So this one should return in March for St. Patrick's Day. And it's possible Tai Chi will return in February as well. So we could be seeing some good emotes return soon. And Well Rounded is an emo I think people don't really realize it's kind of rare. Like it's not been out in almost 500 days. Reminds me of the robot a little bit from season 3. But yeah, it's a good emo. So moving on to Uncommon, they do have Breezy and next to Breezy is Bring It. These are two pretty rare emotes. So yeah, that is going to be all. I'm going to have to rate this account a 9.3 out of 10. It had many rare item shop emotes and some really good skins as well. Let me know what you guys think, but thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.